Hi, Moglets. So today we're going to be summoning for Ganyu. I would like a consolation or two, but there's a twist. So I kind of have a bad habit with like clinging on to words or phrases and uh, overusing them to death. And so to punish myself for this, we're going to watch some recent videos I made. Uh, not in their entirety, obviously. Dude, <laughs> I literally haven't even started and already said it. Okay, well, I guess we're starting. <laughs> I swear to God, that was not on purpose. Uh, this is going to... This is gonna be expensive, I guess. Um, we're starting with the first tin pull. I should have said it doesn't count when I say it in the actual video we're making today, but... So from now on, it doesn't count. So let's go ahead and do this tin pull, but then it doesn't count for the rest of the video. That... That's too much. We didn't get a five star, so I think we can more or less skip. I think all the four stars are C6 already. So yeah, the actual phrase we're looking for is obviously. Uh, I say that too often, even when things aren't actually that obvious, but I digress is another big one. You know, you can just leave that phrase out and nothing changes. So we just move on to the next topic. So we're starting with the beta raising video. Let's see how long we can get in before I say it. Charge and offensive stats. Obviously a little less energy recharge. Ah, because there it was. Have... I mean, the first obviously was seven minutes in. I think I was already too self-aware at this point. <laughs> but anyway, there it was. Oh dang, I also forgot to check history. Where are we at here? Uh, we got Shin very recently. So our pity should be at 17 now since the uh, thing hasn't updated. Anyway, next in poll. Can we get an early five star? Nope. Uh, but I guess that means we can uh, more or less skip. But yeah, why I'm trying to get Ganyu constellations? Well, she is probably one of my most wanted C6 units. We're <laughs> It doesn't count for this video. We're not going to be able to get her to C6 today, but you know, any progress counts. C1 already sounds pretty good. Cryo res, 15%, regenerate two energy. C6 sounds so fun though, uh, because with C2, you get another charge of trail of the whatever. And then here, each time you use it, you can insta fire a, a frost flake arrow. It just sounds like one of the funnest C6s ever, and I would want it eventually. Uh, C1, like I said, already sounds good, so I'd be happy with that for now. And then, you know, in like seven or eight years, maybe we get our C6. Anyway, back to my video here. I do notice that I, I say it a lot more once I'm actually building and trying to explain a character. Because, um, you know, that's when the obviously comes out. But uh, we'll see here. Charge hard. I can't see anything that's going on. I mean, it's a ley line. It's obviously not difficult, but I also oh, went in it. There was the next just... one. We're already near the end, and let's say it's only been the second, obviously. I don't know. I could have missed one, but I don't think so, because I'm snapping at it, you know? <laughs> but all right, next in pull. I think we must be at 27.37. I don't know. Uh, for you guys, it's probably only a few seconds in between summons. For me, it's like five to ten minutes, so... Um, it's not very hard to lose track. There was the next summon, nothing special, unfortunately. Yeah, back to the video. I don't know, maybe I'll just like do a rapid fire, obviously, like six times at the end. <laughs> Especially powerful in multiple enemy situations uh, for obvious reasons. But ah! yeah, I mean, I don't <laughs> For obvious reasons, I guess we're gonna count as obviously because it's interchangeable. For obvious reasons, just takes longer to say. So I'm gonna count that. Next in pull, can we get a Ganyu, please? Nope, just a four star. Who is it though? I want to know. Ooh, wow. All of them. I'd be really... Well, no, I'm still happy about it. It's 15 masses st Stardust. Thanks. As always nope. for watching. <laughs> that was it. And until next time. We're going to have to go back a bit to my Crimson Hu Tao video. Maybe I was less self-aware at this point. It does definitely have its downsides, obviously. I mainly ah, just not there doing it is. <laughs> I said naturally, and I was like, oh, that could have been an obviously. But then I got... But then I hit you with the obviously, but still, we were almost eight minutes in here before the first obviously. Am I still too self-aware? Maybe I'm reading too much into it and I actually don't say obviously that, that much. There was probably like one or two videos where I just really spammed it. As I was editing that one, I took some mental notes. Uh, but I digress. We're gonna go ahead and do this next in pull, as we did say obviously. Still no five star. I have no idea where we are in pity. It's been over 40 minutes since we started this video, although it's probably three minutes into it, if not less. But that was nothing. Back to the video. Just shy of 35k HP, almost 2000 attack, obviously goes a lot higher. Oh my god. Okay, not even 20 seconds later. We got the next obviously. Let's do it. Come on. We must be getting somewhat decently close, but uh, there's a four star again, and it was just a bow. Uh, do we still get... I think we still... Oh, no. That sucks. Wait. I could have sworn we got masterless even for... Oh, wait. 
Ah, there it is. Just two though, unfortunately. Maybe I should watch a summoning video and count the unfortunate or unfortunately's. We'd be out of primos in no time. If we don't get at least one Ganyu, then yeah, that's probably what I'll do. Back to the video. E, but blah, blah. It's obviously not great. But oh my God, no, stop. <laughs> okay, now we're at nine minutes and there was another one. Let's do it. Come on, five star time. Come on, what? And we still have to win 50-50, so we, we could not even get a Ganyu on our next five star. Uh, we did get a water dude, Sing Cho, so um, five stardust, I obviously, wow, I really can't help myself. Well, I mean, okay, spare me a little bit because the whole video is on this one word, so it's like in my brain very hard right now. I probably am looking a little bit too deeply into it. I just thought it'd be a funny little video. Uh, anyway, that was that tin pull for that, obviously. Let's go ahead and go back. Helmet's mastery on it, at least, and some crit damage. Her stats are obviously different. I'll try and Oh my like god, no! Like 20 seconds later. Yeah, it's always when I'm trying to explain something. Then I have to throw obvious everywhere. I don't know why. I mean, I do think most of the time when I'm saying obviously, it is pretty obvious. I just don't know. I just don't know why I say it. Like, what's the point? Um, okay. Next tin pull. Wow, they're really packed in like a, a two minute segment. I, 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 don't, I don't get this. Um, here we go, please. Five star? Yes, five star? Who's it gonna be? Ganyu? Oh, <gasps> Mona, no. That's not who I wanted, but Mona's cool too. I haven't god moded her yet. I think she is C2 now. Little unfortunate, I will be honest, but hey, double five star? I think it's happened to me maybe, no, I mean, Bones it happened to recently. Uh, the double five star. Me though? Has it ever happened? I don't know. I summoned on Bones' account and it's happened to her at least twice, maybe three times. I think it maybe happened to me on weapons. I Well, I know it happened to me on weapons once, but as far as characters, double five star, double five star, you can do it to me. Come on. Hit me with the double five. It would be uh, no double five. Mona was first, which means we should be at nine pity, I suppose. So, already got a bit of a start there. Her pyro is obviously a little higher as well because of the Oh my god, dude. Another 10 seconds. Yeah, you have crimson. You don't need to say it's obvious though. Well, when I really think about it, maybe it's just a call for the viewer to sort of pay attention. Why is it obvious, you know? Because we have crimson. And it could be a lot of the viewers that watch my channel aren't that experienced with the game. I'm not really sure, but by saying obviously, maybe, you know, it gets them to think, why is that obvious? I guess it does beat explaining uh, yeah, we have more pyro damage because we have the crimson set now, which its two-piece set gives us 15% pyro damage. And then the important thing is we said, obviously, which means another tin pull. May we get lucky? An early five star? Uh, let's see. This is still very early, so, um, but yeah, we got a stringless. What's actually up with weapons? Uh, ammos and vortex. Not really interested in either of them, I think. But alrighty then, back to the video. She's doing 70 before and now 69. Obviously, it would be best if I could just get Ah, there it is again. Next tin pull. Here we go. You know, I'm switching between screens and everything, so I gotta make sure a little bit. Another four star, unfortunately. What do we got? Uh, just a Yinfei. Alrighty. Back to the video. But I digress. I'm still a little confused why. <laughs> and then there was the uh, I digress, but I think that was the first time in these two videos, so <laughs> that was kind of the first phrase I really stuck on to. Here, just throw Albedo in there as well. She obviously does have a higher overall potential. Oh, than there we go. Shown. The next tin pull. We're actually running pretty low on Primos here. Um, I would like to really get at least one Ganyu though. That would be nice. Yin phase for days now that I don't need them anymore. I remember I struggled so hard to get her to C6, like three banners and a lot of primos on those three banners. And now she is like, I, I don't know how many we've gotten, probably enough to see six her from scratch. But yeah, we still can pull a little bit more if we got some more obviouslys to uh, go through here. Very sad. I guess we'll grab it later. So that'll do it for now. So yeah, obviously my Hu Tao, I guess wasn't- Yeah, there it is. Okay, yeah. This one was really packed with obviouslys. I don't know what count we're at now, but some. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and go back. The next tin pull, what do we got? Please give us the Ganyu. That would be nice. It's not, it's a four star. Another Yenfei. What is this? It doesn't matter, I technically. 
It's just a kind of a slap in the face to get all these Yinfei's now. All right, we're gonna go over to another slightly older one, but we're going to pass the farming because like I said, usually when I'm trying to explain something is when the obviously just come out. Quick lesson on base attack. Perfect condenser Attack, but then 741 base. So obviously straight off the bat- the Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Literally, literally three seconds into quick lesson on base attack, we got our obviously, man. We're like farming obviously here, okay. Next didn't pull, I suppose. Ta-da! No five star, very sad. Wow, a Ningguang though. I don't know why I'm more happy to see a Ningguang. Maybe just because she's not in the banner. Let's keep going here. Mass uh, Engulfing Lightning has a decent base attack on it, whatever. This obviously has a lot more, but it's not going to increase. Yeah. There it is again. Another 40 seconds in. We can probably buy some more pulls with our Stardust or Star Glitter or whatever. But I don't know if we'll have enough for the rest of this video. Another purple, unfortunately. Let's go ahead and skip. And another Yinfei. I don't know what's going on with that, but whatever. Back to the video. I still do think it would be generally pretty good uh, for most damage pull arm users like Xiao. I mean, obviously his signature weapon is in the same- There damage. it is again. Oh yeah, we're already out of Primos though. So let's go ahead and head to the shop. Uh, see what we got going on in Paimon's Bargains. We only have 95. I thought we had more. Oh, yikes. Let's grab 15. Wait, who's in here? No one I need right now. It resets in 21 days. Well, we're gonna need summoning for Yaimiko, of course, as well. So so we should be able to get those 14 masterless if you know like Elisa, Kaya, Kaya comes back in the shop. So we're doing this tin pull now. Please. Ah. We must be getting at least a, a little bit close here. Didn't we start with like 50 freaking orbs or whatever? And then like 14k primos. We ha we started with a lot and we're down to nothing. We still haven't gotten one gotten you. Not, just, not, not for C1. So yeah, it's kind of, kind of being a poopy head right now. It's not as good as with Staff of Homa. Obviously, Staff of Homa is just, just crazy. No, nah, there it is. Obviously, Staff of Homa is obvious. Uh, This would really be the last pull I can do, unless I'm going to pop out the credit card. I don't really want to right now. It's just kind of a hassle. Let's, come on, please. Yes, yes, thank you. I didn't want to have to, I didn't want to have to wail. This should be our Ganyu. And we're out of Primos. Everything kind of went perfectly. There she is. Mm, nice and delicious C1. Uh, may we get a double five star? How about my C6 Kaching? How about that? Ever thought about it? I deserve a double five star once. Maybe it has happened. You know, and that's why it'll never happen again because I'm that ungrateful that I forgot about it. But I guess I do have kind of an excuse because Bones is constantly getting double five stars and I summon on her account somewhat often. Um... No double five star. Uh, and there's our Ganyu. All right, pretty cool. So now we're going to do it. Uh, activate. Charge level two Frost Flick Arrows or Frost Flick Arrow Blooms will decrease opponent's Cryo Res by 15% for six seconds upon hit. Also regenerates two energy for Ganyu. This effect can only occur once per charge level two Frost Flick Arrow, regardless of Frost Flick Arrow itself or its bloom hits the target. I mean, I assume this will decrease the Cryo Res of everyone it hits, not just like the first one, because also the bloom that spreads out, uh, that that counts, that will activate. She's not really built right now. I'd probably do a little showcase or something, but but eh, it's not gonna be a massive difference either way, I suppose. Uh, it's 15% cryo res and two energy. It'll make her a little stronger. I don't know if it's showcase worthy though. So yeah, uh, I hope this video will turn out well. It's I don't usually do stuff like this, uh, going back and forth and all that, so. I probably messed something up. I know the background audio of the game and YouTube share one audio track. So I hope that also works out. Make sure to tell me what you think in the comments down below. Again, I just wanted to do something a little different when it came to my summon sessions, cause we usually do one or two summon sessions per month and you know, it's always the same. Go there, summon. I figured, why not give it a little twist? We could do other little challenges as well, maybe more in game. That would make everything a lot easier. But yeah, that'll do it. Make sure to drop a like or subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content. You know it's always greatly appreciated. Thanks, as always, for watching. And until next time.